Welcome back to the Mad Spideyverse. I'm Mad Spidey. And thanks once again for tuning into my channel. Uh, so today's video will be, um, well basically I, I got a box when I got home from work from Pop Culture, which uh, obviously not, not a very big box or anything like that, but um, if you, you may or may not have seen in previous videos and things like that, and even um, some videos that Simple Simon has done as well that I've been a part of. Pop Culture is basically one of the biggest uh, shops, distributors of um, yeah, pop culture sort of, you know, statues and, and toys and collectible stuff and things like that here in Melbourne. Uh, pretty much probably in Australia, I'd say. They're the ones that actually import all the pop vinyls um, and then basically, yeah, redistribute them to other shops and things like that. Um, so with this box, uh, yeah, I, I ordered some, I, I basically got told from my pop guy, Andrew, from uh, Pop Toys, who uh, in my last video obviously did that big pop vinyl haul. Um, like, the, it shows just the level of customer service that he provides, that he basically said to me, look, there's a couple of pops that uh, pop culture will have that I can't actually get unless I get them on the secondary market. Um, so your miles are just, you know, order them straight from them because they are like their exclusive for over here. Um, so yeah, just, just that level of customer service is just absolutely fantastic. And that's why I've stuck with Andrews for, for so long. Um, cause he'll pretty much say, look, this is what I'm getting you. I can't get these. This is where you get them from. And yeah, like that's, that, that's just top shelf type customer service. So yeah, very, very grateful to Andrew, um, for letting me know. So I jumped onto Pop Culture, ordered them. Now I know one of these is one of the box sets, so I think you get like a pop and a t-shirt and stuff like that. Um, the last time I ordered one of those from Pop Culture, I ordered it in like a, I don't know, we'll say for argument's sake, I ordered it in like, I think February or March or something like that, and it was supposed to be released a month or two later. So you order it as a pre-order, you have to pay for it up front and it took almost a year to get to me so whether it got lost in the system or not yeah i don't know whether that that kind of customer service is great they should be sort of emailing you saying look it's been delayed or we didn't get the shipment with the t-shirt size you want or something like that not necessarily the greatest thing but uh it arrived that is the main thing so but with this one, um, it was another pre-order, but they pretty much dispatched it within a couple of days. So they must have already had some stock available already. So anyway, I got a box, arrived today. You know what it is? It's mad mail call time. So let's get stuck into it. All right, so obviously this will be a fairly, fairly short one because there's only a couple of items in here. That away. Don't show that. All right. Get rid of all the uh, packing material. Uh, the other thing that uh, I did order, as I said, there's a couple of pops in here. The other thing I did order, and this is how they get you. Like it's realistically uh, doing the proverbial three steps, you know, or say two steps forward, three steps back. Um, like the pops came to, I think something like, oh, I think it was like $60 or $70 or something like that. And of course they have, if you order $100 or more, free shipping. So I'm like, it's only an extra $30. I'll find something to sort of order. So I'm like, I decided like, cause I, I really like the fig pins. Um, you may or may not have seen fig pins before, generally sort of in a small rectangular sort of enclosure, really big, uh, sort of basically a pin or a badge, whatever you want to call them. Um, so I'm like, oh, I like that one. I'll, I'll order that one. And it came to 99.95 and I'm like, you serious? I can't find anything for five cents to be able to do it. So I just ordered another fig pin just to get it over there to get the free shipping. So as I said, two steps forward and three steps back. <laughs> but anyway, I had a little bit of spare money. So I thought, let's just do it. So I'll show you the fig pins first, actually. 
So they did a range, and like the fig pins sell out really quickly. It's very hard to get certain ones. Um, but they did a range of the X-Men animated series fig pins. So I was able to pick up Beast. Try and get that without the glare. So very, very cool. And picked up Sabretooth. So yeah, they're very, as you can see, like there's the, the size of my hand. Like I haven't got massive hands, but size of my hand. So they're, they're a fairly decent size sort of pin. So yeah, very, very cool to uh, add them to the collection. I only, I have maybe about 10 or 20 fig pins or something. I don't have a massive amount, but uh, it's always, always cool to get some more anyway. Uh, so, the first one is just a standard pop, but as I said, this one was classified as a pop culture exclusive. Uh, and that's the unmasked Spider-Man from No Way Home uh, in his Iron Spider outfit. So, very, very cool. So, yeah, so you generally couldn't get that from anywhere but pop culture, as I mentioned. Um... Same goes with this one as well. Now, as I said, this is actually one of the one of the packs. So it's from Spider-Man No Way Home. Uh, now, I'm just trying to see if it actually tells you. Okay, so it's literally just the T-shirt and the pop itself. It's a very cool looking box. And then it shows you what the uh, Popping the t-shirt will look like. So while I've got it out, might as well open it up and show the inside. Take the uh, shrink wrap off. size so there's the uh, t-shirt because I obviously because I haven't got enough t-shirts actually this is very large that's right I don't mind baggy t-shirts and here is the pop itself so it's actually a uh, which they haven't really done much with the um, with the superhero stuff um, and it's actually from the diamond collection, so it's actually a glitter. Don't know whether you can actually see the glitter on it or not. Yeah, very, very cool. So, there's the back showing you some of the other range and the, uh, the No Way Home stuff. So, yeah. So, very cool. Just a small little uh, mad mail call opening. So... Hope you enjoyed the video. Obviously, don't forget, if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, give me a thumbs up, comment if you wish to leave one. Greatly appreciated for each and every one of you that uh, that watch and comment and like and, and everything like that. So, hope you enjoy the rest of your day and Spidey out.